wrong, pal. Hmm? What is happening? Aren't you happy to see me, Carby? Come on, Carby. We have a fight to win. Hooray! Hooray! We're the top of our lives! We win! I'm hooked to the capsule, and I'm coming back to the starship. I'm looking forward to seeing our friends again. Ferox! Fixion! Zen! But... Why are they waking up? Hmm? I cannot find an explanation for this stasis they are in. One time I had too much to eat and I wound up sleeping for 16 hours straight! No, Q. I do not think that is what is causing this stasis. This must be the work of Galacticor. Never fear, Hydrostar. We will find a solution together. The main thing is that we are reunited with our friends. What's wrong with these tests? Why don't these sleeping beauties wake up? I'm actually a little jealous. I'd like to get some sleep myself! Unfortunately, we have no time to rest, Carbodon. Galacticor is still out there and he's planning to attack. Who knows what he has in store for us next? My power! The source of my power is here. The Force Scepter allows me to control the Anti-Substance, making me an Anti-Substance Super Commander! Now, thanks to this Scepter, there is no choice but to submit to my awesome might! Somebody is coming. I'd better place the Scepter in a safe place, a secret compartment. No one will ever discover my secret. My Lord? Venon. You have proven to be the most reliable and courageous of my commanders, so you'll have the privilege of overseeing a special mission. Take this good-for-nothing mealworm with you. He can atone for his crimes by following your example. Very well, my lord. Soon I'll be making an example of you. Galactica, your days are numbered. Hydrostar, I have the first test results. Their vital signs, heart rate and blood pressure, all seem to be slowing down. But are they okay? Yes, they just appear to be hibernating. Well, that's great. I guess it means they're suffering from brown mercurian bear syndrome? Toxin, this is no joke. It's all part of Galacticor's evil plan. Do you think that Galacticor set a trap for us? If we even tried to wake them up. Do you think something would go wrong? Don't worry, Carbodon. I trust Electron completely. Our friends on Ferrum are hard at work on a solution. Anti-Atomicron soldiers, follow me! Our mission is simple. Burn the Atomicron headquarters to the ground. Uh -oh. <clears throat> We're under attack! Atomicron soldiers to battle stations! Yes, Commander! Yes, Commander! commander. Uh, Man the mini movers! Defend, defend our, our headquarters! headquarters. <laughs> soldiers, close ranks! Fire! Molecular shield activated! Atomicron, you can't fight from every angle. Uh, we'll show them. Atomicron, reply to the enemy's fire now. Fire! 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 Ah, this was only a diversion.
by a thousand atom planets, things are taking a turn for the worse. Atomicron soldiers, strike back! We will never surrender! Failure is not an option! Here it is, our precious interstellar energy, the most powerful extra-dimensional energy ever developed. This energy should now be strong enough to rescue the entire Atomicron community. Would you share its infinite power with Electron and the others? I honestly don't know, but what about you? Do you really want to see the Alliance in ruins? We're not part of the Alliance! Their problems are of no concern to us now! You wouldn't speak like that if we were attacked by Galacticor. Oxyjet, Mutant Silver, we are under attack. Sub-Zero is doing his best, but the situation has become dire. We need your help. The Alliance is counting on you. You are our last hope. I will make mincemeat of you! Even if you possess our vehicles, we are much more skilled than you! And we will render them useless! Hurry! Run away! It's going to blow! Ah! Our enemies are excellent shots! Sub-Zero, I've got you this time! My Lord Galacticor, we are ready! Excellent work! Proceed with our plan. We must reduce the Atomicron's headquarters into rubble. Yes, sir. We will act upon your orders. But not for long, Supreme Commander. Master, on a scale of one to ten, our chances are about one and a half. Um, Master, aren't you getting nervous? I sure am. Q, look. How many times do I have to tell you that all this worrying is useless? We need calmness, control, and tranquility. Q! Eureka! I have done it! We are saved! Calm, control, and tranquil, eh? Master, you just gave me such a fright that my circuits would have to be removed completely if I ever want to relax again! Sorry about that. I have found it! I have discovered the antidote that will wake Ferox and the others up from their suspended animation! Where is it? What is it? It is being kept inside the Dark Fortress. In Galacticor's lair? What? Won't that be a little difficult? Starship One, are you reading me? Hydrostar! Nothing. There's no connection. Dear me, things just keep going from bad to worse! Fighting at your side has been an honor. Ah! What's happening? Oh, we were winning. Ah! 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 Huh? This is truly heaven sent. Uh, I suppose no one will doubt our allegiance now. Indeed, I would say that we've come to a clear decision. So we're a part of the Alliance again? If so, let's drive the enemy away and rescue our allies! Come on, let's do this! Hooray! Reinforcements have arrived! I am very pleased that Oxygen and Mutant Silver have made the right decision. Atomicrons must be united. Although I worry about Hydrostar and the others, why do they not answer? I fear something bad could have happened to them. Engines are at top speed, but we can't even move 1,000th of a light year. Fire! Fire! All the artillery we fired against it has done nothing. It seems to be indestructible. Not only that, we're going to run out of fuel soon. So what the devil is this gizmo? It's an X-Vortex. <laughs> ah, now I understand. Thanks for clearing that up, Hydron. It's a quantum anomaly which sucks in anything in front of it. How much quantum? Too much quantum? Carbon, it's a space hoover. Hmm. Toxin? What do you mean? It's a figure of speech, Hydrostar. 
It's a vacuum. Toxin, you are a genius. I still don't understand anything. Neither do I, but I'm a genius. Our shots haven't scratched it because they were fired at the surface. But it's a vacuum, and I don't mean a Hoover. So that means we can decide what goes inside it. Let's put some positronic charges along the entrance. And when the X-Vortex devours them, it will collapse from the inside and then explode. Yeah! Sometimes we have to be inventive. If we want to strike at the heart of the enemy. The mission is complete. Soon the Atomicron headquarters will just be a pile of ashes. 